While coming back from home earlier today, I read through this particular story and I got very inspired. I want to share this story with you. Hi there friends, thank you so much for watching. In this session, I'm going to talk about uh, Julie. Alright, so Julie is a housewife, okay, a typical housewife that takes care of family, right? And then um, she goes to meet her doctor, alright, and she happens to be an obese person. And her doctor has been telling her for many months, right, Julie, you have to go to, uh, you have to exercise, okay, you have to exercise at least three times a week, and every time you have to allocate like 20 minutes uh, every time you exercise, and then you have to control your diet and so on. And many times, Julie, after hearing the same advice, she will go back for the follow-up session only to know that nothing happens. So something like this happened in one of the follow-up sessions. And then the doctor gave her an idea. The doctor said, okay, Julie, do like this. Now, we are going to meet next month. So in this one month time, what you are going to do is that every night, okay, while watching your TV, I want you to march. Okay, I want you to march for one minute. That means her task every day would be to march in front of her TV just for one minute every night. So now, after a month, the follow-up session, all right? The doctor was asking Julie, Hey Julie, how are you doing? Uh, what's the update? And then Julie was like, Doctor, you are not going to believe me this. The first two weeks, I admit it was quite tricky because I have to march and I have to jaga my family, I have to prepare the food and all that. But after two weeks, I cannot undo it anymore. It becomes a habit. Now, doing that, spending that one or two minutes in front of her TV marching is not an issue anymore. The doctor was so happy and then the doctor said, Okay, Julie, we are going to make just tiny changes every week. We are going to make tiny changes and one day, you are going to spend 20 minutes doing your workout. Here, the activity that the doctor asked Julie to do, which is to exercise, seems challenging at the beginning because she saw it as a one whole activity, right? So she, she became fear. There was fear inside her body and then she decided that this is not something worth pursuing. But once we break down into smaller steps, smaller actionable steps, then it becomes very easy to perform. This is what we call the Kaizen way. It's basically a philosophy of continuous improvement. As we do this uh, consistently, okay, as we take these actionable steps consistently, we will achieve greater results. So I wish each and every one of you, no matter how big the goal that you are going to achieve, break them into small series of actionable steps and you will achieve greatness. By the way, my name is Naresh and I am your goal buddy.